Today I'm gonna try and uh, do my bumper with you guys. And uh, this is the first time I'm doing this with Plasti Dip. So, I thought it'd be a little helpful for people who are thinking about it. So, here we go. All right, so these are the tools that I thought I was gonna need for this project. I just bought paper towels, a blade, a screwdriver, some tape, masking tape, alcohol to wipe off the dirt and the oils off the grill, and then Plasti Dip. All of this at Walmart I bought just today was about 20 bucks. All right, so the first thing you wanna do is you're gonna wanna take off these retainers on the top of the grill. There is six of them. So there's one, two, three, and then three on that side. So the way I found out how to uh, take them off is uh, you pry right underneath, right underneath here, and you just lift it up. And pops right out. It's one of these. So you just push in and then pry up and then it'll come right out. And then you just do all six of them. And that's it. Well, not, that's not it, but that's all of the uh, retainer pins. So there's three on this side, and then three on this side. All right, so the next step, there's about three, uh, six uh, clips that you have to undo that's in here. And I'm not sure if I can, I'm gonna try and get it for you guys. It's right one's right there and you have to reach underneath see if I can get my hand underneath there it's this one right here and there's like a little clip underneath here I don't know if you guys can see that but you just push underneath and just push out Alright, so these are what I was talking about, these uh, little clips here. You have one, two, three, so three on each side, you have six in total. So what you do is you reach your hand in between the grill and you, there's these little, little clips that you push up like this and then you push it out. And then you do that for six of them and then they should pop out. So this is a 2015 model. I don't know if the other models will be different, but it just comes right off, right after you do that. All right, so what I'm gonna do first is just wipe it down with some soapy water and uh, get all the dirt and the grease, whatever it might be on the, uh, the grill. Actually, what I'm going to try and do is try and get the back plate of the the dark inside of the the um, grill and try and take it off, try and separate it. Alright, so I got the 
the chrome part of the grill off of the black part of the pla the black past plastic part. I think it'll be a lot easier because I'm just painting the the chrome part with plastic dip. So it's the same way. There's retainers, just like how they were on the bottom, but it's a lot smaller. And you just take those ones out, and then it'll pop right out. It's a little hard. You'll need a little screwdriver for it, um, but. This way, I think it'll be a lot easier. Now that we got the bumper separated, now I'm gonna apply the first coat of Plasti Dip. Plasti Dip. Alright, so I've applied the first coat of Plasti Dip and now I'm just going to let it cure for about 15 minutes and then I'll apply the second coat. Alright, so this is the uh, finished product with four coats of Plasti Dip and four coats of Plossifier. But I think it looks nice. Overall, it looks nice. The next thing is I think I might do is the, uh, the rims. I don't know if I should. It's pretty a long process if it's, if it's raining. But uh, yeah, let me know what you guys think.